Another day, another test. Here we go again with uh, PLA smoothing. Uh, eventually I'll get there, I hope. Today we're going to use concrete sealer. Uh, it's a clear one and uh, just happened to have a little tiny um, pot of it. As you can see, it's, it's really small, only 20 litres. That should be enough to um, coat the model with a bit of luck. And uh, I'll give it two coats and we'll see how we go. Oh, it looks glossy enough. We'll put it down, let it dry, and uh, see what the result is. Or maybe give it a little bit more. Give it a good old uh, coating, as they say. Uh, you will, of course, need a brush cleaner. We we can't afford to uh, waste my little brush here. It's so I just happen to have a again just a small small pot of uh, thinners. And as you can see there, that's another 20 litre drum. Yes, you always have to pre be prepared, as they say, and uh, make certain that your brush is uh, nice and clean. I'd hate to have to waste it and buy another one. I can see a bit of a gloss on it, so I'll put a second coat and uh, see how it goes. Just opening up the tin, and here we go. Wouldn't hold me breath though, that's uh, <laughs> just a thought I had for um, smoothing, because uh, I use a bit of clear concrete sealer every so often, and just happen to have 20 litres laying around, so there we go. I'll let that uh, dry and we'll check it out. Probably go inside to check it because it's getting a bit on the uh, warm side out here at the moment. Okay, I've brought in the little model. It's um, had a bit of time to dry. Ooh, maybe not, it's still tacky, sticking to the uh, paper at the back. It's um, definitely a bit shinier. And you can see the matte finish on the top where no sealer was placed and down the bottom where the concrete sealer has um, been applied. And as you can hear, still plenty of ridges, you can see them probably too. Although it is getting a bit thicker down the bottom there, um, but I think that's still too soft. Oh no, it's not. Okay, now that's interesting. It is actually layering and filling up the gap. But basically I think you'd probably have to put heaps of um, sealer on and uh, really not worth it. So I'll consider this um, idea waste of time. Don't bother doing it. Anyway, thanks for watching.